In Prince Edward Island, it's hard to take a step without bumping into fictional character Anne of Green Gables. Anne is everywhere, especially in this shop in downtown Charlottetown. Fans of the book will be delighted to find items such as the raspberry cordial that made Diana drunk in one chapter of the book. Most visitors will head to Cavendish in north central PEI to visit the Green Gables house. Lucy Maud Montgomery is one of Canada's most prolific writers, and her most famous character, Anne of Green Gables, is celebrated all over Prince Edward Island, and Anne's whole imaginative world has been recreated here at Green Gables near Cavendish. The house of the book was inspired by a farm site once owned by Montgomery's relatives. The house is furnished to portray period setting described in the novel, complete with the dress with puffed sleeves in Anne's room. At the entrance of the museum is a collection of pictures and manuscripts of Lucy Maud Montgomery and the old typewriter she used to create the popular red-haired orphan. As well, you can peruse a gift shop to find a perfect memento of Anne's home. In town, visit the graveyard where Montgomery and some of her family members are buried. The author died in 1942. Nearby walking trails with interpretive signs highlight some of Montgomery's favorite woodland haunts. Today, an excellent golf course and an amusement park are next door to the historic site. Visit the Avonlea village of Anne of Green Gables to discover the essence of the small rural village where Anne lived. 